After more than 200 years of running with a volunteer fire chief, the village of Manlius says it's finally time to find a full-time paid person to do the job. News Channel 9's Jeff Kulikowski talked with the mayor about what a paid chief can mean for the department and the community it serves. Not only does the Manlius Fire Department serve and protect a few thousand people in the village, but also many more in the town and helps do the same with neighboring departments and towns. Manlius crews run not just on fires and emergencies, but about 1,800 ambulance medical calls a year. The job is more involved. It's, I would say it's more like a business now. It's not just um, volunteers showing up to the firehouse when there's a, there's a call. Worrell says the chief is in charge of everything from payroll to purchasing, managing equipment, millions of dollars worth, by the way, to scheduling and proper around-the-clock staffing levels. Despite its coverage area and location of the year-and-a-half-old firehouse in the town, Manlius Fire is a village department. With 11 full-time and 6 part-time paid firefighters, it's the largest village department, but the only one run without a full-time paid person. It's a hard job, especially as a volunteer. Yeah but they just don't have the time mm -hmm. to meet with us on a daily basis. I can call my DPW supervisor and say, hey, I need you over here right now. We gotta discuss something. Yeah. I can't do that yeah. with, with yeah. the fire department. Yeah. The mayor says this didn't come out of the blue. He says they've been thinking about it for at least a few years and studying it closely for a year and a half, even looking at neighboring departments like Fayetteville that did this two years ago and DeWitt that's been running with a paid chief for almost two decades now. The continuity and cohesiveness mm -hmm. is important for the organization, for the village, and for the people in the community that we protect. It all has to flow together, and this, is, we feel, is what's got to happen. And it will, very soon. Jeff Kulikowski, News Channel 9. Now, the mayor also tells us applications are being accepted until the end of this month. He says the job will pay between sixty-five dollars and $85,000, and the village has already accounted for it in the budget being put together right now. Worrell says the goal is to have a paid chief in position by the start of the next fiscal year, June 1st.